Hello internet, and uh, this is the Clark Knight. Yesterday, Pokemon Go came out. So, it came out about last night, and me and my brother both got on right away. Like, okay, we're going to play this game. We, uh, we started out just walking around our house, walking around outside. We didn't find, like, any Pokemon. We found one. We found uh, Drowsy right down the street. And uh, that was a pretty big achievement for us. But I think... They're more popular at night because we went this morning and we couldn't find any. So uh, uh, we then that night went around driving in our car really slow, like 10 miles per hour. One of us would have our phone out checking for the Pokemon. And uh, once we found the Pokemon, we'd catch it and then uh, pull over to the side of the road. My brother would catch it as well because they're in the same spot for both of us. And uh, we did that for about 30 minutes, and we got six Pokemon. Uh, I'll put a picture of all the ones I caught if the app ever uh, opens up again. But right now, the server is down. And uh, everyone in my area has been experiencing this. I don't know if it's just like an Ohio thing. But uh, yeah, right now the server is down, and we can't play. We can get like maybe a minute or two, like once an hour. But, uh, yeah, uh, it's kind of disappointing when you're driving somewhere and you're like, oh, this is a new area. Uh, and then you get there and you're like, oh, server's down. But I'm level 4, almost level 5. I'm excited to do the gyms. I don't know what, uh, I don't know what team I'm going to pick. I'm thinking yellow because it seems like that's going to have less people on it. So it's going to give me more gyms to battle rather than to just defend because I'd rather battle than defend. But, uh, yeah, that's how it's, uh, going so far. I thought with the Pokemon that, uh, like, you'd catch all the water Pokemon by the, like, bodies of water. But I was up at, like, a bakery this morning after my run, and, uh, I caught a horsey. So I was like, oh, this doesn't quite make sense. So, and we also thought, like, different areas would have different Pokemon more logically than they do. So we checked a cemetery looking for Ghastly. And I thought it was going to have it, because in the cemetery's gym, the, like, Pokemon on top of the gym was a haunter. So I was like, okay, so maybe the person who, uh, who took this gym just stayed here and caught a bunch of Ghastly. But, uh, not so much. We didn't find any. But it's so crazy how, uh, how many, like, Pokemon centers there are, like, or marts, so to say. Because we went into a park last night. And there was like, oh, fountain number one, uh, collect three Pokeballs. Fountain number two, collect two Pokeballs and an egg. Which I haven't hatched any eggs yet, because you have to walk a while. So I'm going to have to keep my app open, which just kills data if I'm not in the house. So, uh, yeah, that's kind of how it's going right now. I, uh, a few funny, uh, story, well, not stories, but like, I've seen Pokemon playing, people playing Pokemon out, like, uh, this first day and uh, this morning I was running and then I took a drive around the park to see if I could catch any more and I caught like a Meowth, I caught a Venonat but uh, I saw a few a few kids running like on the high school team and they all had their phones out just looking to find some Pokemon and I don't know I'm just really excited to seeing people getting back into Pokemon because it's been a while you know it's been like uh, it's been a bit but, yep, that's all I uh, had to say. I'll see you in the next video.